Hello once again, this is Orion Syndicate 910. Thanks for watching. Um, I wasn't going to make a video right away after my last one, but this video I think needs to be made because there is a new uh, bit of malware that is circulating on the internet and I found it on my own computer uh, yesterday morning. And it took me a while to finally get it off because I didn't know how to remove it quickly. Um, the malware is called Desktop Defender. Actually, Desktop Defender 2010. It claims to be an anti-spyware program, but in fact, the program itself is malware. It's malicious software. It gets onto your computer, and uh, while you are on your computer, you'll see all these pop-ups come up about you have a worm, you have a Trojan, there is another computer trying to connect to yours and all these other things. These warnings are false because if you click on uninstall or remove worm or whatever it is uh, going on, what will happen is you'll be told by the same program you have to buy the full version of Desktop Defender 2010 in order for the program to remove the spyware, trojans or worms, whatever is infecting your computer. Now, um, once I was aware of the malicious nature of this software, and I'm not really not sure even how I got it in the first place, I think I visited a website and it downloaded onto my computer and it was there working its way into my system for a few days because I really didn't see this problem pop up until like uh, two days ago. Uh, and I did a bit of uh, browsing on the internet to find out what it was and what's really going on and um, I found the fastest way to actually remove it from the computer. Uh, the fastest way to get rid of it, actually to begin to get rid of it, because this program is it's tenacious, I gotta say it, because when I was aware of the problem I tried to run uh, the two anti uh, spyware or, or antiviral software that I have on my computer and they got about 10 to 12 percent along in the scan when the entire computer would lock up. It's like the desktop defender was trying to defend itself from being deleted because I would, uh, the computer would freeze and then the screen would turn pink or turn green or something like that and um, the virus, whatever this thing is, malware, uh, actually seemed to be defending itself against being deleted. And there are programs out there that they say that you can download this onto your computer and some of them are free and some of them are um, uh, cost money but uh, the fastest way for me to get back on my feet as far as my computer was concerned was to do a system restore now what is that if you're new to computers uh, this is um, a feature in your computer especially for those of you using Windows XP that allows you to take your computer settings and take them back to a point before a particular piece of software, in this case Desktop Defender, was installed on your computer. What you do is you go to click Start, which is in the lower left hand side of your screen. You go to All Programs, then you go to Accessories, and then you go to System Tools, and then you click System Restore, and it should take you back to a particular point. You can just follow the wizard that's already installed in the System Restore. Once you do that, there are other programs that you're going to need. Um, one of them is CCleaner, which will go through your computer registry and will remove a, a lot of the bad programs that are there because Desktop Defender, it doesn't go down without a fight. If you have it on your computer, you have all kinds of files littering your computer hard drive, and they're just all over the place. So you'll need to get rid of them all and there are two programs that I recommend for that and both of them work very well for me. One is of course CCleaner and the other one is Super Anti-Spyware. Uh, I'm going to include links to these files at File Hippo. and there's another antiviral software called AVG which uh, you might want to give that a shot too. Uh, I have uh, the link for that program. It's These are all free although there is a I, I believe a paid version that you can purchase but if you want to get rid of Desktop Defender 2010 on your computer now, uh, these four things will work out very well for you. 
uh, as I said, sea cleaner, uh, anti spyware, I'm sorry, super anti spyware, and the AVG antivirus program, all of which are available at File Hippo. So if you're having problems with uh, Desktop Defender 2010, uh, System Restore, CCleaner, Super Anti-Spyware, and AVG, uh, those four things should get your computer back and, and running at a, um, at a pretty good level. As for myself, I found the home page that claims to be the owner. Actually, I had found it uh, because once I rebooted my computer, um, I lost the link. But what I plan to do, uh, since the distribution of um, harmful software via the internet is a federal crime, once I find the home page of the people claiming to sell this stuff, I'm going to go to the nearest FBI office and file a federal complaint against them. And these people could find themselves trying to face down the FBI, which is, as I can tell you, it's not a pleasant prospect for any human being. Anyway, uh, just thought I'd pass the word on to you. If you have Desktop Defender 2010, um, follow the instructions in the sidebar and you should be okay. This is Orion Syndicate 910. Thanks for watching.